I'll hold the door. Please come in and just sit here for a while. This is our way of telling you we need you in our lives. There's a void without you there. Something's missing in the air. Can we just turn this mess into a dream? Cause we know we've been thinking about you lately. Knowing God can save you from that stressful thing that keeps you from coming out to Epic. Cause you know that we've been needing you. I'm really happy she's like uh, here right now. So thanks, Connie, for being Connie. Susan, I'm grateful for you as a friend. You've been a good friend. Something I really appreciate about Christina is that, um, well, I've known her since um, I was a sophomore. And um, it's been, you know, pretty cool guys to know her through the years. And um, I just remember her just being. Me and Omi, um, back in the day, me, uh, Mandy, Larry Pal, and her instead of the library. And uh, it was just fun uh, being able to think over there. So, thanks for seeing that. One thing I really liked about Janice, when I first met her, I think I was playing Lee with her, and we were talking over Skype, and like, the first thing I really noticed about her was how enchanting her voice was, like, just over Skype. Eileen, she is probably the most interesting person I've ever met, in a good way, because she's always smiling all the time, but sometimes it's a little too much, no, just kidding, but yeah, she's cool. <laughs> Another thing about Christina is, everything that I've known about who she is comes from Natalie, and uh, even before I met her, um, Natalie just said like the coolest and most awesome things about Christine, so in fact, when I first met her, I was kind of intimidated, like, oh my gosh, like, what's it going to be like? And just talking with her and seeing how down to earth she is and, like, how big of a heart she had to have for God and wanting to, like, follow him. It's like, I don't, I'm really glad that, like, she's in Natalie's life because, I don't know, I think that's, like, a really big influence for her. Um, and, yeah, I'm just really um, happy that she's been checking out. First side is... Extremely loving, extremely beautiful, extremely perfect. I hate Crystal. So, I remember that we went during fall retreat. It might have been spring retreat, but 
we joked around about feeding you to bears first if we got lost, but don't worry. Probably fed you last. We got stuck in like a water river, and this was like all before retreat even happened. And it's just because we were too lazy to Google Maps and print it out before we came. But I mean, I like that you're always like down to do things, and I like that just because we got lost, you like didn't think anything bad of it. It was just like, oh, another adventure, and it's just like you just seem like someone who'd always be down to go on adventures. And I think that's like a lucky and rare trait to find in people. And uh, yeah, I'm just glad that you got to be in my car for that. Cause we've been thinking about you lately Maybe we can serve you, love you, thank you For the way you touched our lives and blessed, and blessed us Cause we know, cause we know that you girls are the best Hey, what's up, Howard? <laughs> Howard, do you have a shout out you would like to say to all of the epic ladies? Thanks. Is there anything you would like to say to all the ladies of epic? Daniel? Yeah, I would say... Epic is Howard. Thank you. <laughs>